guys. We're at a very special unboxing slash review. And uh, go ahead and unveil our unboxing for this episode. It is the Ministereth, GW Ministereth. Um, they're very rare and uh, quite cool. And we got one in the box, wrapped up and sealed. We took it out of the box just because it's kind of a chore. So we need to do it. But we'll go ahead and show you and uh, we'll review it like I uh, similar to what I did with Helm's Deep. So, uh, All right, so. basically, uh, since he's the Gondor player and it's uh, going to be his crowning jewel. So it comes in a uh, foam like that. So does Helm's Deep, but when I bought Helm's Deep, it, it didn't come in a box. So uh, it comes wrapped up. Everything's nice and protected. All right, so we'll go ahead and uh, just take it out piece by piece, I guess. Yeah. So a feature I like is it comes with like felt under on the uh, bottom, and so this is the uh, this is the gate, um, and it opens like so, and it's you know it's pretty firm like it takes a little bit of pressure to open it, right? So that's the gate. Yeah. So. Uh... <sighs> You excited? Uh, yeah, I'm really excited. This is kind of like just a nice, just final one of the final things I want to do with my Gondors get a Ministereth because they've been in my army. So I've always wanted one, but then they went out of production and found one for pretty cheap. So this one has felt and just like a tower it has a little hatch hatch on top. None of it opens or anything. Door. Yeah, there's another door right here. Door right there. Yeah. And we'll show it put together yeah. at the end. Here's one of the walls. Look at the detail on that. Yeah, it's just, I mean, it just feels amazing. And uh, you got a lot of room on on the walls. You could probably put like three ranks or something. Yeah. If you wanted to. Okay. Here's the other towers, yeah. the same as the other one. Yeah, they're identical, so... And they all come with these little bags, which is nice. Here's my favorite part though about this, or one of my one of my favorite parts, is on one of the walls it comes with like writing on the bottom saying it's Lord of the Rings, Return of the King, Battle Games in the World of Middle Earth, and then Games Workshop like logo. Mm -hmm. So I thought that was pretty nice. It's just like a, a really amazing model. So. You can put it together in several ways, but I'll show you the way I've been putting it together. Uh, this is the way it shows on the box. Put this tower here. Like this. The gate goes in the middle. Looks like we're out of space. Yeah. pretty long. Another gate goes on like such. I'll slide this over a little bit. Alright. So that's uh, what it looks like put together. Yeah, so uh, like so yeah, that's a good piece. It's probably one of the better fortresses GW's made. If you want, let me see it, I'll show. Okay. This is just what it looks like, you know, like how big it is, what it looks like from behind. So it's just fabulous. It's pretty awesome. So that's about it. I mean, we'll try to get a battle report with it in, in it. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's a very special unboxing. It's a very rare model. Um, don't see too many of them nowadays. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, please like, subscribe, and comment. Happy Wargaming.